What is going on guys? My name is Jay Gray BKK and yes, Battlegrounds is officially out on mobile devices today for the official Android device beta and I am super excited about this game being on mobile because I love playing the game on my PC but now I can play the game anywhere I go right here on my phone. That is absolutely great but it's not as easy as just going in and clicking that install button like you can see that I've got right here. Okay, a lot of people is gonna, are going to be able to see that, hey, this game it's not available in your country or maybe you don't have a device that's that it's available for it. But I am going to show you how you can download this game today and get everything up and running and ready to go. So the first thing that we need to do, we are just going to jump right into things is you need to go into your settings, hop on over to the apps and you're going to go down to where Google Play is. Once you get down to the Google Play application, you're going to want to click into that, right? Where is it? Right there. Click into that. And we're going to want to make Google Play forget where we are. So we're going to go ahead and we are going to go down to the storage, click that, clear the data. And that's going to say, hey, Google Play, men in black and just fry their brain. And then we are good to go on that front. Next, you are going to want to open a VPN. A VPN is a program that makes uh, wherever you're surfing the internet from, think that you're surfing from somewhere else. Terrible explanation, but that's pretty much what it does. So what you need to do is you need to pop on over and you need to get an application like Tunnel Bear that I have right here. We're gonna open up Tunnel Bear and Tunnel Bear is just awesome. It's a really easy application to use and it's, I mean, it's cute too, all right? You got a bear that tunnels. So anyways, once you open up Tunnel Bear, make sure that you open up this menu right here and you can go through and you can select the country that you need. Now it is very important, this is one of the most important steps that you select Canada. Once you select Canada, it's gonna go over to Canada and it's gonna ask you, do you wanna to tunnel to Canada? And yes, I do. So we are gonna go ahead, we are going to do that. And now it is time for Tunnel Bear to tunnel over to Canada. We'll click that connection button and you'll see that he will dig all the way from Thailand where I am right now up to Canada. All right, that's the second step. That is uh, very, very important that you do that. Next is gonna be the step where I have screwed this up so many times, I can't even tell you anymore. But you need to open this up and right up here, you can see that I have my mobile data and my Volt or uh, VOLTE on and you need to turn that off. So turn off your mobile data, turn off your Volt and make sure that you are on a Wi-Fi network. By doing that, that means that you can see that, oh, no, you can't see it. Well, that just means that I am now surfing the internet, so everyone thinks I am, from Canada. The next thing that we're gonna need to do is we are going to need to make a new Google account, which means a new Google email. And Canada is one of the nice ones. You don't need a phone number to make a Canadian email account. So what we're gonna do is we are going to open up Google Chrome right here, and once you open up Google Chrome, it's really important that you make sure that you are in desktop mode. So make sure you open up the settings for Google and you click that little checkbox right there. Uh, this just makes things a little bit easier when you're starting to run uh, through everything. And trust me, it's worth it. Then you click your little picture and then you scroll all the way down. You can see I already have two Canada accounts. I'm doing this again because I screwed it up the first time. Uh, whatever, I can make another one. So we're gonna go right here. We're gonna select click or select manage accounts, then we'll go down again, manage accounts one more time, and we'll go down again. We will, no, don't sync. We will go to add accounts, and this is where you'll make your new account. So then you put in your pin, and once you put your pin in, then you can scroll down. It will ask you to put in your email address or phone number, you don't do that. Instead, you're gonna wanna go over there to create account. You click on create account, it's gonna ask you for your first name, and we're gonna say Canada A. Eh? There we go, last name, uh, BKK. That sounds great. Click next. Then it's going to ask you uh, to put in a phone number and right now it's saying get a verification code sent to your phone. It's I've already done this once so it thinks I'm a robot. So I'm going to go ahead and put in my phone number. But normally you'll see a little you'll see a little option right there to say skip. So let's go ahead put in my phone number. And 
And if you didn't put in your phone number, if you did, that's okay. There should have been a skip option. Um, for me though, I've already done this once, so it thinks that I'm doing a robot thing. Anyways, we're gonna just put in our new birthday, which will be today in my actual birth year. Gender, we aren't gonna give them those demographics. Moving on, we got this. Now we're gonna need our username. This is gonna be uh, J Gray BKK Canada three. Next, then we're gonna create our password. Ah, once you have your phone number, or once you have your uh, password created, then you can just skip. You don't need to use your phone number for this. If you use your phone number too many times, they won't let you make an account, whatever. It's all right, okay? Now we have made our account, we can click next, and we are pretty much all but done. Next, what you need to do is down in the description below, uh, after you click your name right here, once it pops up, where are you? There we go, Canada, A, B, K, K, A. Click on that. Now, down in the description below, there is a link for the game. Just go ahead, click on that link, and that will take you to the PUBG page. Okay, and that will open up a website, which is Google Play, and you can download the game from there. So now that this is opened up, you can have the option to open it in the App Store or you can install it right away. Right now it says it's installed. If we refresh that, it'll say it's not installed. Um, open an App Store. It's not installed right now. I just deleted it a few minutes ago. So we'll give it a couple seconds. Let this open up. And once it opens up, you will be able to see that you have the install button ready to go. Now, if you don't have the install button, that's a really easy fix. Uh, all you have to do is make sure that you go back to the Google Play Store and you change your uh, email address. So just click it and then it drops down. You click the email address that you made for Canada. Uh, then you'll be able to open it up and then you can push install. And once you start installing, proceed. And you can actually turn off the VPN now. Let's go ahead and turn that off so it'll be able to run a little bit quicker. And we can also turn on our mobile data again, and we are good to go. So now this game is loading, and I will be right back once the game is downloaded, finished, set. And uh, I'll show you guys what the game looks like a little bit as well. All right, well, we have finally finished downloading the game, so let's go ahead and open this up, and you can see that Tencent Games, it's opening it, it's working, it's great. Uh, and let's just let this game run through for a little bit, and I will show you that this is the English version of this game. This is the version that you want. You won't have to put up with Chinese. You want to put up with a language that you don't understand. Uh, so there we go. It's all almost ready. Come on, boy. Loading up, checking for updates. And as you can see, this is the Pub PUBG Mobile Test. Oh my god, I can't read. PUBG Mobile Beta Test for Android. And it starts today. And then you can log in with your Facebook right there. Get that done. And then it will go right to your character development. And this is where you can make your own character. And so that's going to load up and I know exactly how my character is going to look. There we go. Oh, the graphic requirements. So you can set it on the different ones it looks like. Nope, it looks like it's saying that medium is the best for this phone. So I'm going to keep it at medium. If you have a brand, brand new phone, you should be able to go with, um, with uh, high if you are lucky. So there we go. And since I have already logged in before, there is my character. He's ready to go and he is ready to play. So if I hit start, you'll see that he jumps right in and everything is in English. That is the best part about this way to download it. You don't have to play this game in Chinese anymore. You can play it in a language that you can understand or actually a language that you can read. I don't know if you can read it. I don't know if you can understand it or not. But anyways, that's how it's happening. And there we go. You can see that this game is up. It's running. I can jump. I can go down in the prone. I can kneel. I can punch, punch, punch. And yeah. So you guys, I hope this helps you out quite a bit. Just a few easy steps to recap. Make sure to get a VPN. I recommend Tunnel Bear. There is a link down in the description below for Tunnel Bear. Second, you need to make sure that you clear the storage, the memory storage from Google Play. After that, then you need to make a new Google Play account 
for Canada. You'll use your VPN, go to Canada, then you go make your Google Play account. Once you do that, click the link down in the description below and you will be able to download the game. Once you see that install button, you can go ahead and turn off the VPN, go ahead and turn on your mobile data and your Volt LTE uh you need to have that turned off too when you're doing this otherwise it won't work so you guys i hope this helped you out and if it did please let me know down in the comments what your username is and maybe you know what we'll see each other so you guys that's gonna be it i'm gonna be jumping out here in just one second and i'm gonna continue on playing this amazing amazing game so here we go guys Peace out. My name is Jay Gray BKK. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow me on the, all the social medias. Everything is down in the description below. Peace out.